Big brothers, big sisters of the bluegrass, they are up for the Chick-fil-A True Inspiration Award. So today, Chris Peck joins us to tell us more about this award nomination and how you can get involved. Thanks for joining us. Well, thank you for letting me talk about this. Okay, so this is a big deal for so many different people. Tell us a little bit about what the award is. Yeah, it's a huge deal for us, quite a surprise. You know, we apply for this national award and they only honor five nonprofits over six states. And so Chick-fil-A has created this true inspiration award and truly really to honor and support people they think are making a significant impact in their community. So out of 30, you know, thousands of applicants, uh, we were one of 30 selected across the country. Wow. wow. Yeah. That is pretty incredible right That's a there. Large number to just <laughs> drop down to 30 people. Yeah, mm -hmm. because there are so many local nonprofits. I mean, it's, there are tons and tons of them, so it's a, it's a great honor. What happens if you're selected? Well, two things, really. Number one, we have a chance to win up to $200,000. Oh, wow. wow. Just being a finalist, we get 30, which is great. Uh, it pays for, you know, almost a full staff member. Um, we get to 200, then we get to do really creative things that help our families. Uh, the other thing is, is just the recognition, the brand awareness that comes with this. You know, now, uh, especially being on TV and what the, the stores locally are going to do for us, thousands of people are going to hear our story and hear about volunteer opportunities. So that's just as exciting to me as the, as the money. So how can we help? <laughs> well, you know, there's a great thing today is just to express how, how to vote. You yeah. know, it's, a, it's really simple. You either have the app or you can download the app. Uh, you go to For You on the app at the very bottom, your profile. Uh, you hit, the next thing would be, you hit To Vote. You select the Atlanta region, Atlantic region, and uh, we're the first one at the top. So you're That's only easy. allowed to vote once, but uh, you know, it's just really a, a, an honor. Oh, and there, there she is. India's going Help on there. Help choose hit, a hit. grant winner. Yeah. It's, oh, it's really that simple. Okay, let so me I'm sure vote. I butchered that, but well, it's no, for no. you. That's all right. You're Click right. to vote. Atlantic Region. There we are. Well, now, order something while you're in there. Uh, <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. It, it came is right, right up. Yeah. It's it really as big right brothers, big sisters of the bluegrass. Yes. And uh, let, let's talk something about the, the organization mm -hmm. itself, because this would be great to get the 200000 You already got thirty coming in. Yeah. But you also need people like me in India and others, don't you? That's that's exactly. You know, part of that recognition and brand awareness that we're trying to get is trying to combat our wait list. We have kids that have been identified by a teacher, a parent, a grandparent, saying my child needs someone in their life, another person to support them. And, you know, we have over 150 kids on a wait list just because we don't have enough mentors. And so, you know, we work hard every day. We're real intentional to find these individuals. Uh, since the pandemic, it just has not been uh, as easy to do. So where do we go if we're looking for more information about the Big Brothers Big Sisters organization? Yeah, the easiest thing is to go to our website, which we are renovating, you know, redoing yeah. now. It's kind of antiquated, but it's just bbbs-bluegrass.org. Uh, at the top, there's an inquiry page uh, for parents to enroll a child and for volunteers to get engaged. Wow, okay. And, and what, uh, for those folks out there that are like, well, what do I do if I volunteer? What, what are they expected to do when they go and, and they're with this child? Yeah, I tell everybody, it doesn't take any talent. doesn't matter what age you are. It is really, our, do you have a compassion? Do you have an interest in not just being, talking about the problems in our community, but being involved in solving some of these issues? And so, you know, really they show up one hour a week at a school. They spend time with this child playing board games. They can help them with schoolwork if they want to. My little guy, when I was a mentor 20 years ago, we would eat the school pizzas and we run down to the gym and shoot basketball. Okay. So Now that sounds like a good yeah. time. You're getting some good food and you're getting that exercise right. in. And you can find more information. <laughs> Go over to the Chick-fil-A app and do what India did and try to vote. Right. Oh, I already voted. She did. 